Was there a moment at all, though, um, if you got stunned, and perhaps maybe it was after the knee, or, or, or is there a point in your brain when reality kind of goes away and you kick into instinct or something else just takes over in the middle of a fight? Because there were moments yeah. when I seriously thought, oh, he's, he's knocked out on his feet. Yeah. Like, how is he even still there? Yeah, you know, and, and he did ring my bell. Yeah. You know, he rang my bell <laughs> a couple times. And, it, and I did went into instinct mode. And that's, I think that's, because I don't remember. Right. I remember watching back the fight and 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 watching it, I'm like, wow, I got there. Like, wow, that was me. <laughs> yeah. I was like, cool. I I, yeah. It's like it's like you know, you wake up from a dream and you're like, man, I remember that happened, but did it really happen? Right. You know, so right. so I was in in, in instinct mode. Mm -hmm. So when he caught me with that uppercut, you know, I didn't know what happened. I just remember waking up on a single leg. Yeah, I was like, whoa, I got a single leg. That's <laughs> nice. awesome. That's where I want to be. <laughs> So, exactly. But I was kind of like my bell was kind of rung, so I had to get, I had to get my, you know, my uh, composure back, mm -hmm. and um, that's what I did. So I held on to the leg as much as I could and got my composure back. Then tried to look to finish, and he was defending really well. And then he broke it up, and then, and that's where we had another, you know, um, series of events that went on, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. afterwards. But, but yeah, you know, it was all instinct. Right. You know, from 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 the point where he got me with the uppercut, <laughs> it is, and uh, and and he he had like three chokes on me, yeah. and yeah. I get in chokes all the time with Nogueira and you know Marcel Lozado and you know all the guys I train with, you know, and those guys. If I were if I were to got submitted from the from from Kendall, right. I would have been like insulting Nogueira <laughs> exactly. and Marcel Lozado and all the and Alan Goez, you know. Mm -hmm. So I mean, not to say that Kendall had it tight because it was very tight, you know. Yeah. But I knew how to get out of it because I trained with those guys. Hi, I'm Mark Munoz, and you're watching MMA Heat.